What's cracking you two? My name's Brody and welcome to another Pokemon trading card game opening. And today we have the first Fates Glide boost box from the case being opened today on the channel. Big shout out to Cherry Collectibles for hooking me up with this case on release day. Like legitimately it was like here right on the day. So it is time to crack the seal of goodness but before actually yeah let's crack the seal first let's go let's crack the seal into the first box this is amazing i've been waiting forever for this set like three months it, it goes so quickly but at the same time it feels like it's just been so long since the last set released but check that out guys the seal has been busted we got delphox break on the side there we got uh zygarde on the top there Mega Alakazam on the front, Lugia break, and then we got Mega Alakazam chilling on the back here. And it says here, let's see if we can get a nice shot there. Reality shifts and is remade. Mega Alakazam EX sees the future and shapes it to un unify two worlds. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Uh, <laughs> I did like that intro. Uh, the legendary Pokemon Zygarde arrives in many different forms and brings order together with Lugia Break, Mega Altaria EX, and Umbreon EX. So hoping for some Umbreons. Uh, <laughs> Fates are sealed, and two Pokemon worlds join together in the Pokemon TCG XY Fates Collide expansion. But yeah, check this guys. Let's um, let's knock this camera up just a little bit, because check this. This is the best part. You take the lid off, and then you look down, and you see all these packs. So this is crazy, 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 crazy. But we're actually going to be opening up the whole box uh, in today's video. So this may be long, it may be short, but we will see. So let's stop rambling and get straight into these packs. So we're going to start off with the right hand side and just crack into them in order. Just from front to back. But let's get this camera all set up. And there we go. So we got the Zygarde pack art. Actually, let's have a look at all the pack arts quickly. So there, there we go. So we got the four pack arts. We got Zygarde, Mega Alakazam, Delphox Break, and Lugia. So yeah, they're pretty sweet pack arts. I do love the green theme uh, that they have rocking with this set. So it is awesome, awesome, awesome. But let's go. See if we can save. This. Oh no, didn't save it. God damn. Let's give out the first code of the video. Happy Fates Collide release day. Well, I don't know if this is going to go up on release day, but uh, happy Fates Collide release. Regardless. But let's go. Oh, not bad. So we're kicking it off with a carving, the ability safeguard carving. So this card's actually pretty sweet. We got a dealing in it, and there's also a carving break in the set too, which is pretty, pretty cool. Well, we got breaks in. N. Halucha. A Wisma Reverse, that one's just a common. And a Re Reuniclus Regular Rare to kill it off. It's got 90 HP with Link Fusion. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. So the first pack was a dud. Was a dud. And I believe the code cards in this set as well is a, um, a spoiler, as you guys can see there. It's got the green back to that first pack, so that one was in fact a dud pack and it is living up to the tr tradition as what breakthrough and breakpoint we're living up to so I'll try and try and hide the code just off the top here but yeah I will give out more codes throughout the rest of the opening don't you guys fret about that one but let's go so we've got a bronzor a barnacle snubble a riolu dealing Breaks in, Whimsicott, a Fairy Garden, Rotom Reverse, that's pretty cool, pretty cool. Look at that, is that a rare? That is a rare, cool, cool. And an Alakazam EX, how fitting you guys, how fitting. We Our first EX from Fates Collide is an Alakazam. That is sweet. Check that out, 160 HP with the ability Kinesis and the attack Suppression. So yeah, this is the guy to go for at the moment, um, being the feature. Everyone wants this guy in, in their decks. But that is sweet. Let's throw that one just up the back there. And let's continue on. Continue on. Del Fox break. Second pack in, guys. And we got a reverse rare in that pack as well. So that is awesome. Awesome, awesome. 
Pack number three. So this pack has a Larvator, Cotney, Coughing, Spoink, Minchino, Dugong, Loudrid, Alakazam Spirit Link, a Fairy Garden Reverse, not bad, and a Kabutops Regular Rare. This one has 150 HP with Kling and X Sizzle. X Sizzle. I always say that. It's X Sizzle. X Sizzle. <laughs> Ligio Break. So I believe this is the final, like, first lap of the pack arts. So this is the fourth pack in. And let's go. So we have a Binacle. Snubble. Snivy. Seleucus, Goth Eater, Kangas Khan, a Duosian, Mega Catcher, Duosian Reverse, two Duosian, one pack there with the attack double link, and an x regular rare. So it's got 140 HP with Ambush and Cacophony. Cacophony. I don't know. I don't know what that is. But yeah, let's, let's keep moving on. So nice. Can't believe we've got an Alakazam EX already. That is crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. I think I'm just about to save this pack art. Awesome. Saved. Saved, saved. Let's throw that coat off to the side there. And let's go. So we've got a Fennekin. That Fennekin that was um, in the Chikorita art in Breakpoint. So that's cool. I, I did really like that kind of like crossover with the uh, parallel universes that they keep mentioning. But we've got a double colorless energy, an ultra ball reverse, cool, and a Tyranitar Hollow, cool. So this um this card was in fact one of the pre-release promos. This is the one that I actually got. The Hollow is really hard to see. I don't know if you can kind of get like a shine there, like down in the bottom corner here. But it is in fact a holo. I can feel like the glossy kind of like texture and you can kind of see it. But yeah, it's got 160 HP with the ability Raging Roar and the attack, the attack Dark Mountain with that hefty, hefty four retreat. Wheel. Wheel. But that is awesome. That is awesome. Mega Alakazam, my main man. If we pull a Mega Alakazam full art, I may lose the plot because that card is just incredible. Absolutely incredible. But there is a code for the poll. Enjoy. Hopefully you guys get something good from that code. I'm not exactly sure. I think Mew would be one of the um, targets from this set. Uh, Mew Hollow. So keep keep an eye out for those guys. But we've got a Diglett. Spoink. A Riolu. Solosis. A Fennekin. Servine. Wormadam. A different one. Pupitar. Cottony. And a Mr. Mime regular rare. So the Cotney was just a common. And yeah, then we just got a Mr. Mime. So Mr. Mime has been popping up in a lot of the uh, recent sets as of late. But that art is is nice. I, I think it looks nice just in general. Just easy on the eyes. But it has Mimic and Juggling. Cool, let's keep moving on. So we've got a Delphox Break pack art. Actually, a lot of the cards in this set just look really nice. Like, the Delphox Break is definitely not one to, uh... Well, it, it definitely made me blink when I saw it for the first time. I was just like, whoa. Whoa, that card looks actually really good. But yeah, let's keep going. I wonder what our first break will be from the box. Or if the uh, pull ratios for the breaks are just as good as what they were in break point. But that's another carving. That's not bad. They're pretty... Oh, I guess they are a common, so they should be pretty easy to pull. But was it this Shuckle? No, it wasn't this Shuckle. Oh, it might have been this Shuckle. I know. I was get, I was given a pretty hard time by a Shuckle in the pre-release. But we got a Chinchino. <laughs> Talking about breaks. We got the best break, in my opinion, from the set. We've got Lugia break it's got 150 hp with flash of destruction which says discard two energy attached to this pokemon but that is okay because you just throw a double colorless on there and that's like two energy i'm guessing but that is amazing and 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 then a carbink regular rare so wow a lugia break but yeah carbink regular rare it's got 80 hp with the ability energy keeper and the attack stone edge 
Stone Edge says, flip a coin if heads th this attack does 30 more damage. So you get a potential of 90 damage for that attack. All by chance. All by that flip of a coin. Let's keep moving on. We got Lugia Break. The Lugia Break pack art. Ooh, I can't believe we're just talking about breaks and all of a sudden it was just like, yeah. Lugia's just like, I'm here. I'm here. And then Lugia's the pack art for the next pack too. Nice. So let's go. Three and two. Thought I stopped up the pack trick then, but that is all good. So we've got a Gothita, a Minchino, Wisma, Fennekin, Vullaby, Zygarde. So we've got the 50% Zygarde, Bent Spoon, Altaria Spirit Link, a Kabutops. That one is a reverse rare. Not bad. And a Delphox Hollow. So they love to do this. They love to throw two rares in one pack by the looks. Uh, we got the Rotom and the Alakazam. And now we've got the Kabutops and the Delphox Hollow. But let, let's go through this Delphox. So it's um, got 140 HP with some nice looking art with a more distinguished kind of hollow pattern in comparison to the Tita. But it has the attack flick, Flickering Flames, which says um, it does 40 damage and your opponent's active Pokemon is now asleep. And Psystorm, which says this attack does 20 damage times the amount of energy attached to this Pokemon in play. So that could be alright. It's colorless as well. So that, yeah, that could be pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. But nice. So we, we've got four pulls on the board so far. That's pretty crazy. Pretty crazy. We're not even like halfway through this uh, first side of the box. So let's keep, keep cracking. I'll give away this code. There you go, guys. Hopefully you guys managed to pull something nice from that one. Some Alakazams, Mew, yeah, 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 yeah. So let's go. We got a Dealing, Bronzor, a Riolu, Jigglypuff, Meow, Old Amber Aerodactyl, Chinchino, Shauna, a Spoink Reverse. That one is just a common, and an Omastar Regular Rare. So this Omastar has 120 HP with the ability Restoring Beam and Spinning Attack. Yeah. Interesting art, you can kind of like see that uh, I'm a star in the background there, just chilling. It's like a stop sign off to the side there, I don't know. And I can't quite read what the signs say, but yeah, interesting art. So let's throw that one off to the side and keep cracking. So yeah, I, may, I tend to like to take my time with the uh, first box of every single case that I open, but um, yeah, it's just, it's just so cool. The experience of cracking into a booster box for the first time is just amazing. I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. But yeah, we've got a Lavatar, a Diglett, Splink, Riolu, a Solosis, Zygarde, Wormadam, Fossil Excavation Kit, a White Kieran re Reverse Rare. So this was another one of the uh, pre-release promos. It just has like a stamp there with like a slightly different art. Same art style, just slightly different. But that's cool, the Reverse Rare. And Amanda Buzz regular rare. It's got 110 HP with Bone Drop and Cutting Wind. But cool. I do like that art. I love the uh, flying Pokemon in the sky kind of arts. Like I think it was Staraptor or Braviary in the last set. But yeah, cool. We got a Zygarde pack art next. So let's lift that up. Put the code off to the sword. So I'm just trying I'm trying not to spoil the uh, the pack because the codes are definitely a spoiler I've been kind of keeping tabs on the codes and they are definitely a spoiler of the pulls inside of the packs so I'm trying not to look at them myself but we've got a Wormadam an energy pouch Halucha Kabuto that one is a reverse common with Mudshot and the rare in the pack is <laughs> Yes, we are killing it, you guys. We are absolutely killing it. We've got a Mega Alex Zem EX with 210 HP with the attack Zen Force. That is sweet, say our two main ultra rare poles is <laughs> Alakazam and Mega Alakazam EX. So this looks like it may potentially be an Alakazam themed box. So I'm really looking forward to a Mega Alakazam Full Art, if that is the case. 
but let's go. Talking about me Mega Alakazam, we have a Mega Alakazam pack art. And this one is getting saved. Let's go. So let's throw the code off to the back. And I wonder what our next full art will be in the box. I'm not sure. Like, I've been talking about Mega Alakazam, but there are so many good full arts. Like, there's Glaceon, there's Umbreon, there's even Altaria. Like, it may not be the priciest kind of, like, uh, full art, but it is still really amazing. But we've got a Lavatar and a Grumpig regular rare. So this Grumpig has 100 HP with headwalking and knockback. Cool. So what's that? We got one, two, three, four, five, six packs left in this first side of the box. So let's keep cracking. So yeah, this, this may be a pretty long video, but I apologize guys. Because I just, I don't know, I just talk. I talk and talk and talk. But we've got a Wisma. Minchino, Volibi, Lavatar, Coughing, Kabuto, Omanite, Scorched Earth, so that one's from Primal Clash, that's a reprint from that one. Uh, a Wormadam Reverse, this one is just an uncommon. And the rare in the pack is an Aerodactyl, check that. So once again, a bit of a different art style um, in this one. It kind of looks like the White Curum kind of art, as you guys can see here. I know, it looks similar in my opinion. But yeah, it's got 120 HP with Bite and Jet Draft. Next pack, Lugia Break. Let's go. Absolutely shredded this pack. But you guys will get the code from this pack, so first in best dressed for that one. Enjoy. Enjoy, enjoy. And let's go. What does this pack have in store for us? So we have a Burmy, Cotney, Riolu, Gothita, Wisma, Kangaskhan, Duosion, Scorched Earth. We've got a reverse rare Lucario. So this isn't the steel type one, but that is all good. It has beatdown and magnum kick. And the rare in the pack is... Ooh, we got a Mew. We got a Mew. So talking about this Mew uh, just before, it's got 50 HP. But with the ability and Memories of Dawn, it's pretty OP. So it says this Pokemon can use the attacks of any of your opponent's basic, basic Pokemon in play. You still need the necessary energy to use each attack. And then the, uh, um, the attack encounter, which says search your deck for a Pokemon, reveal it, and put it into your hand, shuffle your deck afterwards. So yeah, awesome setup with the potential with Memories of Dawn to do some amazing damage. But yeah, that is in fact a hollow. You can just see it. Like, only just. I don't know. There you go. You can kind of see in the bottom bottom left-hand corner of the card art. But that is sweet. That is sweet. Let's keep moving on. So we've got a Zygarde pack art. Three and two. <laughs> Piles are getting pretty big. But we've got a Jigglypuff. A Goth Eater, Meowth, Snivy, Seleucus, Lass's Special, Wigglytuff, Ordino Spirit Link, Bronzor Reverse, that one's a common, and then Omastar Regular Rare. So there's a uh, one of the first double ups of the regular rares of the box. Next up we got Mega Alex and my main man. I wonder, I wonder, I wonder when our first full art goodness pull will appear. I'm an absolutely like huge fan and lover of full art. And there are some amazing full arts in this set. But we've got a Diglett, a Lavatar, Carbink, Burmy, Bronzor, a Dome Fossil Kabuto, Altaria Spirit Link, Pokemon Fan Club. <laughs> back to back packs! That is awesome! So we've got the reverse Mew. That is sweet. So there, there's a pretty cool comparison. We've got the hollow and the reverse. Just there. That is sweet. You're going up the back. And we've got a Barbarical regular rare. 100 HP with hand block and claw slash. So we've got two more packs left in this right hand side of the box. And we've got like 
six poles already. So I'd be very surprised if we managed to get anything else from this side of the box. But who knows? Who knows, you guys? Let's go. Because I, I know the breakpoint boxes were averaging about two full arts per box in my, like, from my experience. But who knows? Who knows what the pull ratios are in these these boxes? But we've got a wheezing. That's pretty cool. Love that art. Team Rocket's handiwork. A Chinchino. We have a reverse Windsor This one is a reverse uncommon. And the rare in the pack is... A Team Rocket's handiwork. Full art. So not bad. Not bad, not good. Because I actually pulled this one at my pre-release. Um on Saturday just gone which would have been like Friday in American time but yeah Team Rocket's handiwork not a bad card by any means definitely was um, helpful for chipping away at such a small deck at the pre-release like you got 40 cards and if you flip two coins for each heads discard two cards from the top of your opponent's deck so with 40 cards you're taking away a potential of four cards just by playing this it's yeah a pretty solid hit out of their deck but yeah could definitely see it getting used in um, many, many decks for sure. But not bad. Not bad, not good. <laughs> definitely was hoping for some um, something more that I haven't got yet. But um, it's all good. It is all good. Because I am... Um, I can't remember. I think I had a couple of like trade requests for uh, my Team Rocket's handiwork at the pre-release as well. And I was like, nah... Nah, I don't know, it's just like new, the new feels where you're just like, I don't, I don't think I want to get rid of it yet. Because I know, I know I was going to be opening up my case, but um, at the same time I was like, uh, uh, I don't know. But yeah, we've got an Omanyte, a Helix Fossil Omanyte, and a Rotom Regular Rare. 70 HP with Energy Extract and Plasmic Magic. Cool. So that ends the... Um, first half of the box so let's have a quick halfway mark recap so I'll just kind of like throw this in some sort of random order it's not going to be in like from best to worst or anything like that it's just going to kind of be thrown in like that so we've got the reverses we got a reverse Mew a reverse Lucario these are reverse rares by the way a uh, white Kyurem Kabutops and a Rotom, Polos we got Mew, Delphox and Tyranitar, Breaks we got Lugia Break, that's not bad, we got an Alakazam EX, the very first card I pulled from this boost box, and a Meg Mega Alakazam EX, and then we pulled the Team Rocket's Handiwork Full Art, so that's cool. Not a bad first half of the box. But let's keep moving along. I'm just going to throw them off to the side and get this, like, huge pile of bulk off to the side, out of the way. And let's crack into this second half of the box. Cool. So the first pack, we have a Delphox Break Pack Art. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. So what else, like, so what's that? That's only halfway, and we just have so many pulls already. I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. It just it just feels so good to be cracking into so many packs at one time. But we've got a Helix Fossil Omanyte, a Wigglytuff, a Marowak Reverse, that is a Reverse Rare, and a Zygarde Regular Rare. So I believe this is the first time we have seen this guy in this box so far. That's pretty cool. It's got Rumble and Geo Strike. Lugia Break. So I haven't really been keeping tabs of the pack arts that have been bringing the pulls, but I'll probably I'll probably go back and like um, go over the box and see what uh, what pack arts were getting the best of pulls. So that could be interesting. But we've got a Snivy. Fennekin, oh, there's the there's the art with the Chikorita. So there's two Fennekins in the set. This one has the Chikorita. So that's pretty cool. Pretty, pretty cool. Jigglypuff, a Riolu, Seal, Loudrid, Alakazam Spirit Link, Wormadam, Seal Reverse, that one's just a common, and 
an Ordino EX. So we pulled what I consider to be the dud of the set. Like, I don't know. I don't know. It is a it is a nice nice card, but it looks very plain and like Ordino looks really like uh I don't know like a clay figure. It looks like one of the clay figure kind of arts. But yeah, it's Ordino EX with 180 HP with Drain Slap and Do the Wave. <laughs> Do the wave. So what's that say? It says this attack does 10 more damage for each of your benched Pokemon. Okay. Cool, so you got like a potential of like 110 damage with that one but yeah we started off this in the second pack from the front of the box once again uh, we've got another ultra rare pull so that's interesting we've got Zygarde on this next pack though let's keep moving along keep moving along there is a lot of packs to get through here is a code enjoy 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 and let's see what this pack has in store for us so we've got a binacle Riolu Minchino, a Wizma, Snivy, Kangaskhan, Duosion, uh, Mega Catcher, Delphox Reverse Rare. So we're getting a decent amount of Reverse Rares. So I'm pretty pleased with that so far. And a Superior Regular Rare with Quail and Slashing Strike. Cool. Mega Alakazam. Code off to the side. And we've got a Jigglypuff. We're Spoink and Snivy kind of just chilling. Chilling. We got Meowth. A Barnacle. Snubble. Snivy. Dugong. Energy Pouch. <laughs> Check that. I can just grab two cards. God damn. God damn. <laughs> we've got a Strong Energy. And we've got a Omastar Break. So that's pretty, pretty cool. The second break of the box. And it's got 140 HP with the ability Dangerous Tentacle. So that's cool. Feel free, free to pause and have a read of that one if you guys would like. And then we've got a Moltres Regular Rare. So this is the third of the pre-release promos. It's got an alternate art. But um, yeah, it's got 120 HP with Combustion and Flying Flare. So that's pretty cool. I did kind of hope that I, I got this one as my pre-release promo because it looks pretty cool. I don't know. I like the cartoony styled art there on that card in particular. But let's keep cracking. Let's keep cracking and see what else this box has in store for us. So we've got a Coughing with Division, Snivy, Diglett, Seal, Fennekin, Wormadan, Pupitar, Dugong, Team Rocket's Handiwork Reverse, and a Genesect EX. So yeah, I was actually kind of looking forward to seeing this card because this was like my MVP of the pre-release. Um, it's got 180 HP with Drive Change and Rapid Blaster. But yeah, I was kind of like, I didn't see anyone pull this card at the pre-release, so it is nice to get hands on uh, with this guy, considering he was my MVP of the yeah of the pre-release. <laughs> But yeah, let's keep going. Keep going. That card is pretty, pretty sweet. Um, I did rather enjoy using Rapid Blaster. It was just like pretty much a one-hit KO for um, anything I went up against. I think the only Pokemon that gave me trouble was White Curum. But yeah, it was it was pretty pretty solid. But let's go. Actually, Carbon gave me a lot of trouble as well. But we've got a Snubble, Burmy, Cottony. Ariolu, Gothita, Fairy Garden, Shuckle, Chinchino, a Fennekin Reverse, and a Grumpic Regular Rare. So this is the second Grumpy of the box, I believe. But yeah, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Next pack, Zygarde. So we're almost halfway through this second half of the box. We've got three pulls. There is a code. Enjoy. Enjoy, enjoy. I haven't actually opened any packs on TCGO yet of Fates Collide, so I wouldn't have a clue like what to really expect, like pull ratio wise. But yeah, hopefully you guys get something nice from those codes. But yeah, we got a loud root. A bent spoon. Pupita reverse, that's cool. And a Rotom regular rare. So this is the second Rotom regular rare of the box. So that's cool. It's got energy extract and plasmagic. Cool. 
Mega Alakazam. Mega Alakazam. So we've got two breaks so far. We've got a couple of ultras. I can't remember how many ultras we've pulled. We've got one full art. So I'm potentially expecting one more full art, maybe a couple more ultras, a couple more hot yeah. There's still a couple of pulls to get, so there's plenty to look forward to in these final packs. Definitely, definitely, definitely. But we got a Chinchino, Shauna, Servine, a Shauna Reverse, and a Lucario Hollow. Just as we mentioned that we're still expecting something. Uh, we pull the Lucario Hollow. It's got 110 HP with a Vacuum Wave and Fight Alone. But yeah, this art's pretty cool. you got kind of like Mega Alakazam chilling up the background there, being all like godlike. But yeah, I love this. I love this art. It was definitely a standout for me um, upon first glance. And not to mention it is uh, fairly playable as well. So that is always a nice bonus. A nice art with playability. But cool. Let's keep cracking. It is definitely going to be a long video. I apologize for the length, but it is all for a good cause. And... The, oh, these boxes are just amazing to open and I thought for once I'd actually yeah I'd actually like open the whole box in one video but yeah we've got a carving reverse that's good and a reuniclus regular rare but yeah I, th I thought for once it'd be nice to open up a whole box being the first box in one long video for you guys and as close to release date as possible as I could Considering everything else usually takes pretty long for me to um, get out to you guys just due to uh, release in Australia. Like, they're pretty slack with getting things on the shelves depending on where you uh, live and, like, where you go. Because I'm on, like, I'm on the outskirts of, like, Brisbane City. It kind of, yeah, it just takes a while for things to kind of make their way out this way. But, yeah, we've got a double colourless reverse. That's cool. And... A Lugia regular rare, so this is awesome. So this one is one of the uh, main mans in the theme deck. But it's got 120 HP with the ability Pressure and the attack Intensifying Burn. Which says, if your opponent's active Pokemon is a, a Pokemon EX, this attack does 60 more damage. So that's cool. Love Lugia, absolutely love Lugia. But yeah, we got a Delphox. Next up. Let's go throw this coat off to the side and see what this pack has in store for us. So we have a Vullaby, Burmy, Coughing, Meowth, a Lavatar, Helix Fossil Omanyte, Shuckle, a Chaos Tower. So this is the first I've seen of Chaos Tower in person, but it says choose which way this card faces before you play it. Uh, this down Players Pokemon can't be asleep or paralyzed. If those Pokemon are already asleep or paralyzed, remove those special conditions. And the upside down ability says, choose which way this card faces before you play it. This down player's Pokemon can't be confused or poisoned. If those Pokemon are already confused or poisoned, uh, remove those special conditions. Yeah. So it kind of like points at the Pokemon I'm guessing. Those arrows mean this Pokemon yeah, can't be confused or poisoned, and this one can. But yeah, we've got a reverse Minchino, and as you guys can see, kind of like poke it off the side there, we've got an ultra rare, which is a Deancy EX. So cool. Cool, cool, cool. Deancy EX with 150 HP with Sparkle View and Wonder Stage. And Wonder Stage says if they're is any stadium card in play at this attack does 50 more damage so you definitely pair that up with like a fairy fairy garden or something of that nature but awesome awesome so we got a nice little pile building up on the back which is always a good sign always a good sign but cool so what's that mean we got one two three four five six seven seven packs left out of this whole booster box so that is insane well this pack is sealed pretty tight this code is all yours. Enjoy. Enjoy, enjoy. But cool, that Deancey is not bad. It doesn't look pretty... Uh, like, it's not a standout in my opinion, but it definitely isn't too bad. But we got a Vullaby. Lavatar. A Cotney. Coughing. Spoink. Kabuto. Omanite. Scorched Earth. 
Fossil Excavation Kit Reverse with a Bronzong Regular Air. So this is the first I've seen of Bronzong uh, so far of this um, booster box. It has 100 HP, it is metal, it has the ability Metal Fortress and the Attack Guard Press. Metal Fortress says, prevent all effects of your opponent's attacks including damage done to your benched Pokemon. So cool. That could be nice. Could be nice. For sure. Especially considering there is a Bronzong break in the set as well. Which we should be keeping an eye out for sure. For sure, for sure. So let's save this. See if I can like save this pack art with my little letter opener. Which I have, I have managed to do. Curl off to the side. Yeah, see if you guys notice I like lift the cards kind of like up off cam to like take the coat off. That's just so I uh, prevent all spoilers. I'm, try I'm trying my best guys. I am trying my absolute best. But cool, we've got a Snubble, a Snivy, Salusus, Fairy Drop. So what's this say? It says heal 50 damage from one of your Pokemon that has any fairy, uh, fairy energy attached to it. So that could go nice with your Deante, Deante EX, Alakazam Spirit Link. Whoops, taking two cards again. <laughs> We've got a Windsicott, a Wormadam Reverse, that one is just an uncommon, with a Lucario Regular Rare. So it's got 110 HP with Beatdown and Ma Magnum Kick. But yeah, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Mega Alakazam. So I don't really see too much uh, left to be pulled in this box with pretty much... Uh, uh, I'm not gonna say that because I'm really hoping we got some more pulls, but um, I don't know. I don't know guys It looks like we're heading towards this last part of the box and it's a really sad time for me right now That is all good. It is all good But we've got a Fennekin Carving a Wigglytuff or Dino Spirit Link random receiver Vullaby a white curum. Oh, so that was the reverse. Both be reverse for the being the common. And we got a white curum hollow. Cool. So yeah, this guy gave me a bit of trouble at my pre-release. But um, cool. I do now officially own it. So that is nice. 130 HP with burning icicles and blizzard burn. Cool, cool, cool. So let's throw that one just up the back there. So yeah, overall I believe the right hand side has impressed me a lot more than what this uh, left hand side has pull wise. I think we got a lot better pulls. Especially considering the Mega Alakazams and the Muse and all that sort of stuff that were pulled. Sorry, I'm just, I don't know what I'm doing right now. That pack just didn't want to open really, very nicely for me. But we've got a Lavatar. I've seen a lot of Lavatar as well. Vullaby. Burmy, coughing. Is that like a bug on my hand right now? Check that, guys. I have like a little bug. <laughs> what is going on? What What are you doing in here? Seriously. Get off. Get out of here. Want to be featured in the video. I don't know what that was. It was tiny. It was tiny. But we got a Meowth. That was so random. Like, where did that come from? <laughs> we got a Pokemon fan club. A Fairy Drop Reverse with a Motham Regular Rare. Where did that bug come from? Like, what is going on? What is going on? Lugia Break, my main man. Come through with the goods. We need some full art goodness. We need some full art hype. Can it be done in this pack? But let's go. So we have a Fennekin Jigglypuff. A Riolu, Seal, a Lavatar, Odino Spirit Link, Power Memory, Weezing, Reverse Weezing, and a Snorlax. So it's got 140 HP with Toss in Tan and Swallow. Swallow says, heal from this Pokemon the same amount of damage you did to your opponent's active Pokemon. So that's interesting. So you could heal 50 if you use that. <laughs> Unless you got some sort of a boost. Um, to go with it but yeah interesting 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 second last pack of the booster box guys this is the second last pack oh no no it's gone way too quick it feels like it just like time just flew 
Yeah, let's see if we can end it on a high, night, high note in these two last packs. But we have Acelosis, Gothita, Minchino, Wisma, a Fennekin, Devolution Spray, uh, De Evolution Spray, Omanite, Lasses Special, a Gothita Reverse, and the rare in the pack is, is a Mega Altaria EX. So this is a really, really pretty card. Really, really pretty. It is a fairy type um, Altaria. It's got 220 HP with the attack Mist Purge, which says if this Pokemon has any special energy attached to it, this attack does 30 more damage and heal 30 damage from each of your Pokemon. So cool. That is not bad. Not bad. Check that art. Let me know in the comment section below what you guys think of this Mega Altaria EX art. That's cool. It's, it's so fluffy. Look at it. Like there's just puffballs just everywhere. Absolutely everywhere. So that is our second full art of the box. And I believe that's all she wrote, guys. I believe that's all she wrote. But let's see if we can get some last pack magic and prove that statement wrong. So let's go. There we go. Last pack art has been saved. And for those guys who have made it all the way to the end, there is a code. Thank you for watching all the way through the video. You guys are amazing. You guys are absolutely amazing. But let's go. So we have a Carbink. Dealing. Bronzor. Riolu. Jigglypuff. A Brakeson. N. Love that art. Absolutely awesome. Halucha. A Rioli Reverse. And, 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 and a Marowak Regular Rare. To end it off. So definitely couldn't end it on a high note, but that is all good. All good. So it's got 100 HP with the ability Bodyguard and the attack Bone Meringue. So Bone Meringue says flip two coins. This attack does 60 damage times the number of heads. So, cool. So you can do a potential of 120. So that's not bad. Not bad at all. So here is the stack of commons, uncommons, reverses, and regular rares from this uh, left-hand side of the box. So let's show them off to the side. And let's have a recap of this second half of the box. So we got that. What would be my favorite EX? So we got that one, that one, these two and then yeah that looks pretty solid to me solid this is the order reverse rares in no uh, order in particular we've got a reverse rare Delphox a reverse rare Marowak white Curum Hollow a Lucario Hollow an Omastar Break so that's pretty pretty cool have a nice shot of that one in the light pretty cool and Ordino EX, definitely like not not my favorite pull by any means. Uh, a Deanti EX, definitely a better pull than Ordino. <laughs> uh, Genesect EX, and then we got the Mega Altaria EX full art. So that is crazy, crazy good. Definitely, I'd probably say this Mega Altaria EX would be my favorite pull from the box like this and the Mega Alakazam EX. I'll just grab Mega Alakazam out. Um, definitely the highlights of the box. But yeah, let me know in the comment section below what your favorite pull from today's box was. Um, and just let me know why. It was, was it because of art? Was it because of playability? I'd love to know in the comment section below. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed today's Fates Collide booster box opening, be sure to drop a like down below and be sure to drop a like if you guys are hyped for the rest of the case. I have like another five boost boxes just sitting off to the left of me which I keep looking at because they just look so good and there's so much goodness jam packed inside of these boxes. But yeah, be sure to drop a like down below. Let me know in the comment section below what your favorite pull was from today's booster box and I hope to see you guys in another one of my Pokemon trading card game openings. Thanks for watching. Peace.